Hey everybody, Naruto fan FB. Welcome. Uh, got yourself. It's classy. I feel like it's gonna be that. Like, yeah, welcome. Uh, I told you I'm not dead. Reed's yeah. back. Got Andy over here, and me. It's John. All right, John. so it's chapter six thirty-six. Thirty-six. The okay. current Obito. The lame Obito. Um, yeah. I'm I'm gonna say it. This chapter kind of for me was like, eh. It was a chapter. That's exactly what, and I think it was more the fact that like, some people might have liked this. Some people might have liked the whole fight being similar to them sparring as kids. But I think that it's really lame that they were doing the exact same thing. Like, it, I, I don't know. Like, I played soccer for a lot of my life. I can't imagine myself playing soccer the same way I did when I was five, as like I, when I was seventeen, or when I was twenty one or twenty two. Like, it, it's storytelling. It's not meant to be realistic. I, it's I get that. Stylistic. But... You know how Kishimoto to, loves his parallels. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Sure. It's supposed to have some deeper meaning and stuff. But you want to say something? No, it's I fine. The, I can wait. I hear the sigh. I, I was the exasperated ah, sigh of the first panel ah, where it's like because we were shaping up. Like, Swear oh, to almost, me. This, 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 oh, we're almost dead. No, nope. never mind. Can do too. That's yeah, yeah. Because it was like, yeah, oh man, no, this awesome panel hitter. where it's like, it was like, all right, that's really cool. The double death, but no. And then I was like, nope. yeah, let's not do this genjutsu thing. I don't worry. We'll we'll do that again ten pages later. Yeah, exactly. Double death. Kishimoto can't kill Kakashi, so because of that, he constantly just needs to scare us by, like, putting these panels of, oh my god, Kakashi's dead, and next week he's like, no, he's not. <laughs> just kidding. Because, like, the whole pain thing... Uh, no, that wasn't... Oh, wait, just kidding. That was... He was dead. Yeah, but, like, it's almost like, like doing nah, it, but I then... can't actually kill him yeah. off, and this yeah. is as close as it's ever gonna get, because that was the whole, like, him, like, getting his last moments with his dad, and now his dad can move on. Uh, but... I don't. I don't think we're gonna see Kakashi die, especially after this one. Like, hope he gets stuck in the Kayumi dimension forever, and then has to suffer because he's also immortal there. I bet that'd be awesome. I wonder how he's gonna. I, I'm figuring and that he's, he's the gonna final gonna... villain because he has hundreds of thousands of years to train up. It's like Groundhog's Day. I, I'm thinking. <laughs> Come on, think be fun. <laughs> I'm thinking right. that um, Bill Murray Kakashi's gonna Bill figure Murray. out <laughs> how to get out of. Uh, that dimension because it's Kakashi like he just like he's he can do like it that. he's got the eye yeah he's fine you know, not worried you know they actually added up all the days it took it, like Bill Murray and Groundhog's Day to get out and they like added up to about 10,000 years by like how long it would take to master all the things he did so for 10,000 years that guy was stuck in that one day over Jesus and over again Jesus Christ all right, so uh, so the fight is going like they were when they were kids which is really cast. yeah which is really kind of repetitive and weird. That that's how that fight goes. Cause it, and then uh, it's the story, it's fine. And then they like stab each other, and Obito's like, "Ow!" And yeah. Kakashi's like, "Ow!" Right in the feels. And um, and then Kakashi's like, and then no, Obito's oh, like, Obito "I'm gonna, the... I'm, I'm getting the fuck out of here." He got the worst deal. He got yeah. it right through the middle. Kakashi mm -hmm. was oh, through the side. Really? Kakashi I, got it in the side. But... Obito got it right in the. It looks like the, the reason. Oh, well, yeah, he got it right through the core. Um, one thing that I did enjoy about this chapter was you really got to see how fucked up Madara is. Mm. Mm -hmm. Because, Thinking like, the same thing. there was the whole, like, you thought they were on the same level and that they were teammates and stuff. And did anyone, did anyone expect that not to go down no, like no, no. that? No, no, no. I mean, the if you go back time, to any of our videos, you'll see us all saying, like, oh, yeah. Madara's going to betray him. It's no, the whole time, Obito's talking like he's real big for his britches. Yeah. And like, oh, you know, you need me. Yeah, but Mod but the yeah, thing he's got this. He's but Madara. The thing that bothered me most is like Madara brought this kid in, and you thought like at some point like it was a, a like Obito was young, so you thought there'd be some sort of like connection, and it's obvious that Madara does not like Get view people as people. He views them as tools. He's like, oh, I guess I got to do this. I was, and the best part, he was like, I was gonna wait till after like I think he said after I beat Hashirama. Or something like that. Yeah. But he's like, but I guess I have to do it now, and I can't, I can't use him anymore. And I was just like, dude, like, that's so messed up that from like the get go, it's you're so, like, set on your plan and your goal that you just manipulate yeah. everybody around you, and like, it really makes you like, kind of hate Madara. It brings so, up the yeah. question: Who feels bad for Obito now? Yeah. Exactly. I don't. No one. Yeah, I don't. I don't. But um. Answer zero. One thing that did bother me a little bit, and I mean, this happens with like everything in Naruto. Like, same thing with Pain. Like, the first time we saw Pain or whatever, Pain was, like, a thug. And, like, he was, like, the epitome of strength. And, and like, you thought he and was undefeatable. And you then, also thought he was pulling strings. Yeah, and then you see, then 
Obito comes, and Obito, Pain was so strong, but then the guy that's really pulling the strings is Obito. So you're like, oh my god, Obito's got to be so strong. And then, and then Madara comes, and then Ma- slowly you see Obito becoming this like normal character again that is disposable and can possibly die. And then Kakashi and Obito fight, and like, as the battles progress between uh, Kakashi, Obito, and uh, Naruto, and then later on to the Kakashi Obito fight, I really felt like you just see Obito's power diminish throughout yeah. the whole thing. Like he's not like the moves that I thought he would be pulling out and the strength he portrayed earlier in the show and in the manga are it's not at the same level anymore. There's, there's a, a, there's a dis- trope for this, but I can't remember what it's called. I'm gonna disagree a little bit and say that as long as he has the element of surprise and you don't really know what he's doing, his power is fucking unbelievable. Yeah. Once Naruto and Kakashi start to figure it out a little yeah, bit, especially gonna... fighting inside that dimension, he yeah. doesn't have any more get out of jail free cards when he's in and there, other than going back out. That was the one thing I was gonna say, like saves it a little bit because like they do start to understand his power and that he's no longer this person that can't be hit. Um, Outside of that one spammable move, you know, yeah. the, the can't be hit phase in and out, he's all right. Yeah, like. He's only okay. Which yeah, I was me. gonna say he's like he's like one of those no names. Yeah, that's what, it's only like like that's like he's like he's not strong, and you think he would have done like something well, it's, like it's like Megiko. Yeah, he's, yeah, it's, he's it's been all doing... it's all the, the Sharingan. He's been doing the same thing that, in my opinion, Sasuke has been doing since he got Susano. You like, gotta... he hasn't been relying on his fighting ability. He's just burnt spamming but that the power. With, yeah. The Burn. difference between Obito and and Sasuke is. Sasuke's been a genius since he was a kid. Like, no one's mm. ever questioned his power. And if you watch the fight between Sasuke, or read the oh. fight between Sasuke and Itachi, And there's no doubt that Sasuke's put in the work. Yeah, and Sa- yeah. Sasuke, like, was able to get out of uh, Tsukunomi with the regular Sharingan. That shows how powerful Sasuke, and how much, uh, Sa- how powerful Sasuke is, and how hard Sasuke trains. Whereas Obito was, he was a okay ninja when he was a he, kid. He was kind of a screw-up. Yeah, yeah, and, like, he got a Sharingan and saved Kakashi, but then after that, it, we don't really know what's going on with the Obito and Madara, maybe we're going to yeah, find he, out in the next few chapters. He got, he got the power up with the, the Zetsu body. But it's like, mm-hmm. it's kind of like a rare candy in Pokemon. You get, le- you level up, but you don't get the same level up that you would have gotten if you... Well, is that true? Trained. Yeah, you, you're... You, Shit, really? You're, yeah, if you use a rare candy, your attack, your speed, all that doesn't level up the same as if you work for it. Fuck. Pokemon now is just... That totally changes you. everything. Yeah, man. I know. X and Y. Um, it totally doesn't change anything at all for me. Yeah, because oh, I actually okay. worked. Alright, fine. You're the guy that totally like, trained up all of your stupid... Never mind, whatever. I like Pokemon. We've been oh. over this. Oh, God. Uh, Weird. Um, <laughs> my buddy so, had Pokemon in like 10th grade math. That was the first and last I really gave two crap to my Pokemon. Alright, um... Anyway. <laughs> moving So, on. anything else? So, so we kind of see Obito... I was kind of interested because, like, when his face went all black, it kind of reminded me of, of, yeah. of... No, no, it reminded me of, of uh, Sasuke's curse seal when he first used the curse seal. Really? Because, like, remember oh, when yeah. it, like, went, like, half... Uh, See, the thing that. about that, I, I did like that part because it goes to show, like, the whole Uchiha mindset and also the whole, like, manipulating people. Like, Madara had a plan from, like, the day he found this kid. Like, this was not an accident. Like, he was like, oh, wait, I can use all these uh, Hashirama cells to control them now? Like, yeah. You know, the whole, like, borrowed power coming back to bite you in the ass. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, Sasuke was almost down there. I kind of wonder, well, like, how, like, his plan would have worked without Obido had he never, like, gotten yeah. crushed by the rock. I mean, I, I almost feel like Maduro is waiting for something like that to happen because, obviously, the Hashirama thing was keeping him alive. Well, so he, he was biding his time. So. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. But, yeah, yeah he, he was waiting. <laughs> Yeah, so. No, it's it's like many things. Oh, if, if you wait patiently enough for opportunities, the one thing that and got me them, super excited was yeah. Obito's at the battlefield now. Minato saw him. Mm. I, that was, I, there was a so quick wait, panel. Really? Yeah, was I believe there was a quick panel. Oh, that's right. Minato, like, like, I saw that. It's like what the fuck? A, yeah. I don't know if it like it was a reaction to seeing him, but I think it was Minato seeing uh, Obito there and. I can't wait to see what Minato's going to say. He's going to be like... Whoa. Yeah, next chapter's going to be... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, wait. Whoa, this is not my Batman glass. <laughs> like, he's definitely going <laughs> to... He's going to be a little surprised to see Obito 
not, I was going to say, I want to see him connect I was going to say, Obi Wan is the masked man, is the. Yeah, that means, because then he's going to be like, the guy who fucking killed his family. And he's going to spaz the fuck out. So that's going to be really, really interesting to see. Week or two. Yo, this is going to be some drama. Tune in. The Naruto posters tilting. Failure. I can't do it. Yeah, I think that's uh, about all I got. Yeah. Do I we mean, have anything cool going on the page? Uh, we just did a kunai giveaway. Uh, I know ten people won that. Sword. I, I don't know if we're gonna. It's not official, but we. Might, I'm working with this guy Hanzo Sword. I'm sure he's gonna do an introduce like a introduction video at some point, so you guys know who he is. He does a lot of replica swords and things like that. Uh, so check out his website HanzoSwords.com. He's been working with us. Hopefully, we'll get a Sasuke uh, like the, replica sword, the grass cutter sword, the grass cutter sword. Yes. Yeah. So, um, if that happens, maybe we can give away one, two, or whatever amount of those. And nope, so I'm gonna take them all. <laughs> oh, and... so I'm gonna I'm gonna take at least two, and I'm gonna run around my house just like screaming like I'm Sasuke. <laughs> Over and so, over again until I poke my eye out. So <laughs> we're not going to have three because Andy's taking two for himself. So one of you guys gets a sword. That's awesome, right? Yeah. yeah. So wait until next week when we have one-eyed Andy. Yeah. And me and John back here. <laughs> we'll see if I ever did lose my eye, I would require that like my nip ga- my nickname going forward would be one-eyed Your Andy. Nickname? My nip name. Your nip name? <laughs> no. I don't do bedazzle. Be yeah, it'd, it'd, be, it'd be like just a standard eye patch. Actually, you know what I would do? I would just not have an eye patch. I would just kind of just like keep it open. No, I would. To- <laughs> no, no, I should have an open. Like, just have a fucking open socket. Yeah, and I would gross. staple it open. And be like, people don't need to hear this. We're out of here. Wait, All right, see you guys. But wait, real quick, real quick. Okay, wait. If you do want to like, I'm sorry, I was gonna say this till Andy went on his rant about <laughs> poking his eye out. Um. If you're not a fan of the Naruto Facebook page uh, and you want to like wh- have a chance to win these things, um, go to Facebook. If you don't have a Facebook, I don't know where you've been for the last like seven years. Facebook.com slash uh, Naruto Fan FB. Yeah, no, no. Naruto get off FB. Tumblr, get off Naruto Pinterest, page. come to Facebook. Go to the the big Naruto page with like 3.1 million fans and like that ish. And if, you, and if you don't like us, you know what? That's cool. That's cool too, because I have yeah, three point one and other million people that love us, yeah, or like us. Yeah. Well, they like John. They like John. They tolerate you and I. Yeah, exactly. I don't, even, I don't post on that page. I don't really do. All shit right. Well, they page. don't tolerate you. Yeah, then. I know. They don't tell me. <laughs> but we'll see you guys <laughs> next week. Me. Next week's chapter should be pretty dope because uh, we're gonna get to see reaction from Minato yes. hopefully and uh, Obi and Madara well. power the fuck up again. Yeah, and becoming uh, Jinchuriki. I mean, I, we did call that though. Like I felt like of course, well, I mean, it was like it was it was obvious. Yeah, it was no, no. I'm saying like. We said that it was getting really close to the point mm-hmm. where Madara needed to become the Jinjariki. Uh So we'll get to see what's going on with that. And the Kage's Oosh. maybe will show up at the battlefield too. So this is about to go down. Mm-hmm. Boo-boo. Boo-boo-boo-boo-boo. All right, see you folks.